Crystal Traffic, aka Bag of Bitch. He got all the old school classic in the car. All the old school. How many songs you got on that one? I'm just singing all of, you know, all of my heart. That's his, that's his whole hand he made it. It's up. Not cards. <laughs> Kidnap. Speak easy. Black Hollywood Takeover. Y'all know what it is. They come and pick me up right. Got me in this tight ass suburban. We gonna shut it down, man. Uh, tell Mike I meet him at the second show, man. I gotta get down here and get this money. Black Hollywood, speaking to TV, buck wild. What's up, motherfucker? We here. Head into the show. Speak easy. TV. Speaky TV. <laughs> Speaky. Yeah, hey, motherfucker. Yeah, motherfucker, I'm here. Chillin'. Comedian buck wild, live backstage, Pearl Theater. We're on Oxford, North Philly. Stand up at the music movie with my man Keith from up the block. Philly legend comedian Michael Blackson got me started in 1995 doing his thing. Two sold out shows. Over a thousand people in there waiting for him. How do you feel? I feel good. Feel good? It's always good to come home. You know, this was more like something I put together last minute. I'm going to come back and do something to, to the city that raised me. More April Fools. April Fools, it ain't no joke. I'm they thought for. you weren't going to come. If that was April Fools joke, they're like. <laughs> Nighttime, Michael Blacks, and this shit ain't gonna happen. It's crazy. But it's, it's, it's a lot of love, and I'm glad it does. Let me tell you something. This is my city, man. This is Temple Florida. University. Yeah. All this shit went here before I could walk left. outside and I would still get to keep my jewelry. I think. Only okay, maybe not. I might lose my 40 out, but don't let my jewelry stay. <laughs> Only because it's Temple. Mike, you first got me started at the Laugh House. I came in there trying to heckle you. You destroyed me, 95. Then you, I came back the next week. Did it again, you destroyed me again. You said, listen, you got heart, nigga, but you need to learn how to write. And you took me under your wing, I'll never forget that. And then as a favor, you put me on the road with you. And the first time I got paid, I realized I got paid because it said Michael Blackson and Friends. I'm like, yo, who the fuck is the Friends? Where my check at? You, motherfucker, you the Friends. Mike Burke. Michael Blackson. I get the check, and I get my friends. I saw Mike his first fake rolling. Yes, you did. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, no, not only that, this nigga had me on a payment plan. <laughs> Every week. How you got another payment plan on some fake Rolex? 1998. <laughs> um, this, no, I, this, but everything about this guy is fake. <laughs> I don't think his parents are his real parents. This nigga is. But I don't. Let me, let me tell you, I don't be nowhere. If the cops ever, if you with this nigga, the cops come. Just run for your life, because this nigga, we don't even know his name. I know them for 25 years. I don't Easy. know this nigga. Really. The cops pulled us over in 1998. Me, him, Kevin Hart, and Tere. Mike told on me. Mike said he did. Damn right, I told on you. Are you out? Hey, I'm gonna jail for you. He said you Michael Blackson, the African King of Comedy. I don't know this nigga. When I got out the car, he's like, Aziz White, get out the car. I'm like, how the fuck the cops know my name? <laughs> no, but this is my man, right, my yeah. mentor right here. Got me started. Passed the torch to me. I passed the cab. Cab took off. Now so we wait for cab to throw us the torch. <laughs> <laughs> cab getting five hundred thousand. You see this cab? You come back and you do that fucking stadium. You call me, Mike, and Terrain, and you get back. Nah, shout out to my man Kevin Hart on his thing. Mike out LA. He got the movie out. Got a, yeah, got a new show. New Meet show. Us in LA. Me, D. Ray Davis, Gary Owen, Brandon T. Jackson. Brandon T. Jackson. Lavelle Crawford. Look up. Everybody Brandon always be like, how the fuck Brandon get on the show? Because Brandon did the show. He did the show. He did the show. He's a hell of an actor. Now he Brandon. I like Brandon T. Jackson. Big guy. Big Mama's house and uh, Percy Jackson. Brandon T. Jackson. Right. Mom. But uh, what's up? Yo, what else you uh, new you got coming up? Uh, I got a movie coming out with Mike Abs and a bunch of other comedians called Meet the Blacks. It's a spoof of the Purge. Look out for that. This oh, I seen it. Yeah, I yeah, it's coming out really soon. Uh, of course, comedians of LA We're about to work on Report Two. My movie's out there online. It's, Vim uh, it's on Vimeo. Coney Montana, you get that. Besides that, every weekend I'm in a different part of the country. So just He's follow working. me on the gram at the Real Michael Blacks. Every weekend I'm somewhere else. This weekend I'm in Seattle, Washington. Next week I'm in DC. And it was the following weekend I'm in Illinois. And after that I'm in St. Kitts. 
And then um, I come to New York. Our big boy, big shout out to BY Jennings. I'm going to yeah. be the fight. We got to be out there representing uh, Brian Jennings. North yeah. fully got the fight. Right. So every every week I'm somewhere else. So just follow me on Twitter. Okay. And Hardest working dude. Right. Mike Blacks world. and Black Hollywood. Thanks. Real black. Guys, coming from Africa, just trying to fit it. This bitch sold me some fake Rolex. He's so fake, when he wear jewelry, he turned green, motherfucker. The chain turned green when he wear them. I hate that nigga. Put me on a payment for a fake Rolex. How you do that? I mean, why don't you just take your thousand dollars and you already got the thousand dollars from me? Why you gotta convince me this shit's really twenty thousand dollars and put me on a payment? After like three payments, I'm like, this shit ain't real. I realized that this motherfucker. That motherfucker ain't shit, yo. And he proud of it. <laughs> he's seen it. Brock had money with fake money, he's money. He's everything. Yeah. <laughs> this nigga had nothing real on him. <laughs> <laughs> the only thing that was real about him was he was real fake. Yeah, I hope you got some well, Mike said, Mike said, fuck your mom ain't your real mom. <laughs> your pop ain't your real pop. <laughs> the nigga burned me so bad, he did like five college shows, right? He was getting ready. Like, Honey, I'm driving my car. I'm, I'm going to get this motherfucker. I said, I'm going to get this motherfucker. I went to Canal Street, right? Uh, me and Kevin Hart. You want to tell me about this? Yeah, Kevin. You want know, like four fake watches. Kev kept one, I kept one. We saw one of the fake. Uh, Faison from uh, next Friday. Faison Love. We sold one of his ass and we burnt, we burnt Mike. <laughs> <laughs> He's proud of it. Yeah, let me get that nigga back. Nigga, you have to sue me, right? <laughs> For fictation. Yo, what's up? What's up, Cleveland? Cleveland,